Being married 40 years, we've seen our fair share of painful events. But God, he taught us how to love, even when it hurts. Marriage is picture perfect until you're in it. And once you marry, you realize all the hard work it takes. Sometimes you work so hard in marriage that you work against each other. When you first introduced me to Chris, he was doing everything to get my attention. Now it's like nothing. Seems like he's not even interested in me. I just don't understand Samantha sometimes. It's like she don't appreciate what my career is doing for our future. I don't know how when you're not giving me a break. I'm trying to provide the best way I can. So what did the preacher have to say? He said that I shouldn't be selfish, but to love Chris in a sacrificial way by laying down my life for him. Why? So Chris can walk all over you? Girl, there is nothing wrong with you. See, it comes down to this with women. They need affection, they need security, and they need commitment. And they need to know that they're number one. You're right, and I'm wrong but it doesn't matter because I'm always wrong. You never appreciate anything I do right. And I've been bringing money in this house and you still find a way to tear me down. Are you done? We can't agree on anything and everything turns into an argument. Do you think Chris is having an affair? S Samantha, help. And Jesus said, everyone who acknowledges me publicly here on earth, I will acknowledge before my father in heaven. 911, he's laying on his kitchen floor and he's covered in blood. He's barely breathing. He says, somebody quickly. Your enemies will be right you. there in your own household. If you cling to your life, you will lose it. But if you give up your life for me, you will find it.